Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little mix of stuff. There's going to be a little bit of cleaning, a little fall decor, a grocery haul, and also the girls got some super cute items in from a company called Happy and Polly, so I figured for all of my fur baby lovers out there, I would share it with y'all. So I started off my morning with some pumpkin spice coffee with a little bit of vanilla soy milk and some pumpkin whipped cream on top. This stuff is so delicious. You gotta try it. If you like pumpkin flavored stuff, I got it at Target. So now I'm just opening opening up the kitchen window to let some of the natural light in and I'm also letting some fresh air in here as well. The weather is changing a little bit here now so it's time to get those windows open. And a sparkly shimmer on our skin. So we're going to begin with what the girls got from Happy and Polly. I was talking to one of my friends the other day, her name is Shannon, and she was showing me these super cute cat trees from this company, so shout out to my friend Shannon for telling me about them, otherwise I would have never known. So they sent the girls these two items. The first item I'll be showing is their new water fountain. My girls always love running water and prefer drinking water from the sink rather than their bowls. So I was pretty excited about getting them a new water fountain. And it's the cutest water fountain I've ever seen. It's a gorgeous purple water fountain. It has a moon and some stars and a cloud. Kiki and Cookie are obsessed with it, but Cannoli still hasn't figured out what it is just yet. But I'm sure she'll come around, but the other two girls are loving it. And then next, I'm most excited about this because it's been such a long time since my girls had a cat tree. Kiki and Cookie actually used to have one years back whenever we were living in Virginia, but Cannoli's never had one before, so I was really excited about this. And just wait till you see how cute this turned out. I'm just going to show y'all all of the pieces laid out on the floor first and some clips of the girls laying around on all of it. It's like they already knew it was for them. So Alan set it all up for me, and while he did that, I made us a little lunch or brunch whatever you call it i made us these omelets which mind you i've never made a day in my life but alan wanted an omelet so i tried my best and honestly they turned out pretty good for it being my first time inside the omelet i put green onions some ham shredded italian cheese and some mushrooms and of course salt pepper garlic powder and onion powder and yeah they turned out delish so alan just had the omelet itself and i had a half of the omelet with the avocado toast. Okay, so here's the cat tree all set up. The girls went crazy over it. They have been off and on it for two days now. They are totally obsessed with it, and I can't lie, so am I. It's just the cutest cat tree I've ever seen. I love all of the details on it, and I love the colors, and it's just super cute, and it's a perfect size for my girls. If you want to check out the website, I'll have them linked down below. They have so many cute things on there for fur babies, so many different cat trees and scratchers, accessories, things like that. And if you have a fur baby and you like this kind of stuff, definitely check it out. I think you'll love the selection that they have. Just 
So now I'm going to start doing a little cleaning in here. I'm going to unload this dishwasher first and reload it with these dirty dishes. And if you're wondering who I'm on the phone to, you know I'm on the phone to my mama. Okay, so honestly, I was getting really tired and I was way too tired to be up and cleaning and doing stuff. So I just did a little bit of cleaning today. I didn't do that much. I just picked up a little bit, wiped off the countertops, did some vacuuming. That's about it. Not too much, but just enough. some more of my fall decor out I showed you guys that I did a little bit in my kitchen the other day and now I'm just putting a little bit out in my living room and like on the bookshelf and stuff I really didn't put a lot out I kind of have it like how I did my kitchen the other day I just put a few simple pieces here and there and that's how it's gonna stay for now until I am ready to do more I did add this super cute cat throw pillow on the edge of the couch I just thought it looked perfect there and it matched everything when it is freezing, I will keep you warm. I will hold you closer so you don't feel the cold, and it's all for you. It's all for you, it's all for you, it's all for you, I did it all for you, it's all for you. So I did pull my box of Halloween stuff out of our little storage closet just to go through it to see what pieces I'm going to be putting out for this Halloween. And then I also wanted to show y'all this picture that we got a few weeks ago. I'm kind of crazy about it. I really want to put it out for fall and Halloween time, but I think I'm going to keep it out all year round just because I really like it. And it just matches perfectly in my home with my color scheme and all that. All the bed in the hurt. i 
Okay, so now I'm gonna share a little grocery haul with y'all. This grocery haul is from HEB, and I'm going to start over here. I got a pack of sleeping pills, HEB brand of Unisom. I haven't been sleeping well, so I got some of these. I got a box of saltine crackers and some bananas. I got some more of the HEB Mootopia vanilla milk. It's my favorite. I got three Gatorades, two blue, and this one, which is strawberry kiwi. I got the Bolt House Farms Superfood Immunity Boost juice, some orange juice with some pulp, some half and half for Alan's coffee, and I got some little cans of Canada Dry Ginger Ale, a big old pack of toilet paper, and then I got these little pumpkin spice bites. They're like little mini rice cakes they got quinoa and chia seeds and they have a little drizzle on them these are absolutely delicious and I love pumpkin spice flavors so yeah then we also got a lemon pepper rotisserie chicken and a bag of HEB thin potato chips and then I wanted to show you this that my mom got me. She got me this super cute yellow Obvi shaker cup. I got an orange one and then they released a yellow one and I loved it so she got it for me. And it also came with these four sample packs of the Obvi collagen protein powder. I've tried all of them except for the cookie one. This Reese's cup one is my newest favorite. I can't wait to try the cookie one and I've already tried the fruity cereal and the cocoa cereal. But yeah, so these are just like little flavor packs you just put them in a bottle or in your cup or whatever and yeah it's absolutely delicious I didn't record any of me cooking but for dinner I made pork chops squash and zucchini and some Velveeta macaroni and cheese so anyways I just want to say thanks so much for taking time out of your day to watch my video I hope you enjoyed it if you did give this video a like if you have anything to say leave it down in the comments and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet hit that subscribe button it would mean a lot to me I would really appreciate it and I'll see y'all next time bye